For cacao, we actually veered away from the usual production issues because the problem in cacao is actually the uh, lack of uh, primary processing, uh, essentially the fermentation step. This uh, fermentation step actually is responsible for the developing the chocolate flavor and aroma uh, that is characteristic of cacao. So it should not be just dried right away like coffee. No? And this uh, primary processing step of fermentation actually is also, we also do this because we want to develop uh, processing for value adding no? and uh, develop entrepreneurship. As you will see here, for example, uh, if you de develop or make your cacao into tableya, you will earn 10 times more than just if you just sell it as wet beans and let the others do your uh, processing. No? And of course, uh, the, the farmers could also be local processors. So that is where the entrepreneurship comes in. But of course, they have to have good quality. And uh, we have found through this training that uh, some of the uh, processors actually do not have good quality cocoa. No? So they, they don't really taste good because when we train, we actually have a taste test. And sometimes they also bring their uh, products with them. So um, the fermentation step can actually be done in a facility like that, uh, which is a more or less a uh, merit some uh, investment. Or if very small holders, you can use these uh, DA supplied um, boxes, uh, or uh, we can use just the styrofoam box. No? And uh, this shows you what is the uh, stages of the fermentation process for five days. And these are the external and internal fermentation. We give the DU, the biochemical, th the science behind it, the biochemical um, changes going on, and until the final product. After that, uh, there is familiarization with the Philippine national standards for cacao. And um, these um, standards are necessary for our beans to be accepted in the world market. And to do this, uh, we have to do grading. Uh, and for the grading, you have to know what are the defects and uh, how many are of those defects can be found in a lot. So then you can be able to make the grade. And I think there are some interventions here needed for uh, kits to be, grading kits to be sh distributed to growers, processors. So with this, I think uh, uh, we are able now to um, improve the quality of our cacao. And so this can be um, <clears throat> bought by institutional markets and not limited to the local markets. Actually, we have um, only uh, one third is of our production uh, is used for the uh, local uh, processing uh, demand. So thank you very much.